Tiger Woods shot two over in yesterday's first round of the Masters. Tiger currently tied for 54th, but says that in the second round, he's going to look to, quote, inch his way back. Shannon, what did you make of Tiger's first round? Well, Skip, I thought he, all in all, I thought he held it together pretty well. I didn't expect him to be under par. He had only played once uh, since July before the Masters, and he looks a little rusty. He's older now, and his body's even more, uh, <laughs> even more battered. Uh, he struggled on the front nine, bogey three, five, and seven, uh, uh, three, five, and seven. And uh, he had five bogeys and three birdies on his card. Bogey the last hole. Could have really had a, could have had a really nice round had he not bogey the last hole, Skip. Um, and he says, you know, the pain, he said the pain is constant. This is what we know, Skip. It's kind of like working out. When you don't work out for a long time, that first day, you look, you're a little sore. But it's that delayed onset, Dom's. Is that second, is that third day, if he's able to make the cut into Saturday, where the body, because he hadn't put it through that, yeah, the body remembers what it used to do, the swings and all that stuff, but Skip, he hadn't been on the course. He hadn't had to walk and go through what he went through. Remember, he's in the bunker, and he's trying to stabilize himself, and, you know, he hopped a couple of times. His, he knows what everybody else sees. I'm never going to be the same, Tiger. My body's not going to be the same, the same again, and he's trying to pick and choose. Of course, as you said, he's very, very familiar with this course. Is but even familiarity, Skip, when you don't do something for... I guarantee you, Jeff Gordon, you take Jeff Gordon, you take Jeff Gordon. He hadn't driven a, a car in seven, eight years since he retired. He knows Daytona. What's the likelihood you put him in a car and he going to go win? Even if you give him his own former crew, what's the likelihood he get in that car and, and drive it around and win Daytona? It just doesn't happen like that, Skip. You, you got to do this. And golf is a sport, Skip. Man... You can, my brother say, man, man, I hit it great today. Man, I shot 68. Go back out there tomorrow, man, what you shot? 75. Bro, you just shot, shot 68. How the hell you shoot a set? Man, hey, yesterday ain't got nothing to do with today. Ain't got nothing to do with today. 82. <laughs> <laughs> so, and that's what Tiger's up against, Skip. He just cannot, his body won't allow him to put the practice time in, what he needs to be. I'm not saying he'll, he won't ever be that. Tiger Woods that we knew that burst on the scene. We're never going to see that guy again, Skip. But I thought all in all, he held it together really well because this round could have really got away from him. I agree with your last statement. I take some issue with some of your other statements. Okay. Really, if you look hard at his M.O. over the last five years, he has quit prepping for the majors. He just doesn't play a lot of golf because his body is breaking down in ways that were happening before he nearly killed himself in a car wreck. Right. He had one thing after another. We don't have enough show to list yeah. all the injuries, some of them self-inflicted right. because he'd be running in army right. boots because he wanted to be a Navy SEAL. Right. He had ACL. He tore his Achilles, his elbows, his shoulders. It's just been – his body is Kobe-esque in yeah. that it, it just, it's just fallen completely apart. Well, it's being held together with chicken wire and electric tape right now, <laughs> Skip, so – Okay, it's a miracle he's even playing golf, period. Yes. Let alone playing at the Masters. Competitive golf, yes. Competitive golf. So let's go back to 2019. He had barely played in three tournaments. It's, for, for other guys, you, you play six or seven, eight, right. ten tournaments building up right. to Masters. It's, it's like a six-month ordeal. Right. But it's like getting ready for a marathon. Mm -hmm. And he just shows up at Augusta 2019, and he shocks me right out of this chair. He won the golf right. tournament. What? Right. You won the Masters? Yeah, but that was before he almost lost his life. Right. That's before. But he came back last year after nearly using, losing his life with no tournaments, zero. And he walks out on a course he knows like the back of both hands, and he says, uh, I'm, I'll be okay. Mm -hmm. You will? He made the cut. Mm -hmm. He's made the cut 22 straight times as a professional. 22 straight times, it's impossibly great. So is that is that is that what you're going to measure him by now, just making the cut, or is that well, Tiger Woods that we tell okay. him to us? Except we all thought going into this tournament, do I give him a shot? Sure, I give him a shot, right? Okay, here's the problem. He had played one tournament this year before this, <laughs> and it was, quote, unquote, his tournament out here in Los Angeles at Riviera. Riviera. It's called Genesis now. Right. It used to be the L.A. Open. Okay. He knows Riviera just about as well as he knows Augusta the, National. He never played very well because he never won at Riviera, which right. I still can't compute. Right. But the point was, 
he played very, he shows up. Like, n nobody in the history of golf could do this. He just shows up, speaking to your brother. You know, it's just like, just showing up. Like, your brother <laughs> takes six months off and just shows up and shoots 68. Well, you can't. No. Except you're Tiger Woods. Right. So he shows up, and on the, on the first day, he shoots 69 at Riviera. It's a hard golf course. Yeah. I know it. I've walked it a thousand times. He shoots 69, and then on Saturday, what they call moving day, after he made the cut, he shot 67. So he was a credible player right. at the L.A. Open. So that was his one preface to the Masters. Right. He said going into this Masters, my game is in better shape than it was last year right. when I made the cut. Right. Why? Because he had practiced more. So he doesn't play competitive golf to get ready. He practices his tail off. Right. So he had actually over-practiced to me because – when he showed up here yesterday, I was shocked at how much when I started watching in the afternoon, he was limping like crazy. Yeah. Now, this is a really hilly golf course. Yeah. People, you, TV doesn't do it justice. Right. Trust me. I've watched walk this course a hundred thousand times. It is just over. It's it's a roller coaster of hills and right. it's hard, especially if you've got knee problems or foot or ankle. It's just hard on you. So he's, And he got that bad back. He's got a bad back. He's got all <laughs> it's all bad. He, he was asked after the round, how, how did that bad leg do? And he said, it's sore. Right. Well, well, it's sore. Well, it looked bad because at Riviera, he wasn't limping that much. Right, exactly. He, he looked much better at, at Riviera. And that wasn't that long ago. So th that's what shocked me. And now he's got weather issues because yesterday the golf course was begging for somebody to shoot minus seven. And that's what and three people did, did, right? Okay? And Tiger is capable of shooting, I don't know, three, four, five under. And he, he three putted three times on the front, as you point out. He lipped three putts. And yet then, because, listen. His drive, his willpower, it's unlike any athlete right. we've ever seen. I don't know. I'd put Ali up in there. Right. I'd put Jordan up in there. But Tiger's up there. Listen, I'm talking about just being able to focus oh, yeah. your mind yeah. and say, I'm going to right. overpower this. To me, golf is the hardest game in the world, to your point. You have to play it to play it well. <laughs> and and he's, he's actually he's taunting golf. He's scoffing at golf. I, I'll just show up and. I'm Tiger Woods. I'll, right. I'll figure this out. Right. Well, on the back nine yesterday, he started to figure it out. Right. Because on 15, it's the par five. You can go for it in two. He had a 27-foot putt. It broke five feet from left to right. And he drained it and hit it right in the middle of the cup. That was vintage Tiger. Right. He turns right around and goes to the par three 16th. And he drops it eight feet. And that pin was way at the front. And he drains that. And he's birdied two in a row. He birdied 15 and 16. Right. I'm thinking, is he going to birdie hey, out? You're thinking, here we go. Yeah, no, I'm thinking, here we go. He missed a birdie putt on 17. 17. And then on 18, he got the worst break you can get. He had a good drive. I think we have a picture of it. But, but the ball winds up one foot to the right of the fairway bunker on the left side of the fairway. Well, if, if the ball's one foot to the right, where are you going to stand, ladies and gentlemen? Well, you don't have a stand. So right. you got to put one we're foot way bunker. down in the bunker in the sand. And the other one, you got to hike it way up on the grass right. above you. And then you have to choke down on the club and see if you can just duck hook something that'll just run up to the green. And it ran into the green side bunker. What, uh, okay? what, what, what leg did he have the surgery on? Was it his right? Right. It's the one that's Okay, the, but okay, he was yeah. hopping on yeah. his left. And he said, I can hop on my left, but I can't hop on my right. right. Or I got to have big problem. You might need another surgery, surgery right? right. Because as he said, I got a whole lot of hardware in there because it's being held together with bailing <laughs> wire. Okay, I don't even know how he's out on the golf course. Right. And to your point, in the biggest picture, in, at the end of the day yesterday, a 74, it's plus two, two right. over par. It's not bad. Right. I, I mean, all things considered, it's pretty good, right? Well, most guys probably can't take up. Maybe there are a handful but a majority of the guys, even these top pros, not taking off the amount of time and just showing up at this course and shooting 74. Trust me, nobody Every guy, could. Every guy that's in nobody that tournament could. other than him, Skip. You know why? Because they get on the first team, they would not trust anything about their preparation. Right. And once the demon gets in your head, that ball, that little tiny white ball, it doesn't move until you move. Right. It's not tennis where, oh, I can just react. They, they, he hits it back over the net to me, and I hit it back to right. him. It just sits there on that team. Right. And it just stares up at you like, you going to hit me? You can hit me solidly or not? And here we go. And as you know, that hole is very small, and that ball looks even smaller. And it can go sideways quickly. And out on that golf course, 
there's a whole lot of woods and there's a whole lot of water and there's a whole lot of sand. Man, they put me out there on that tee. That, they put me on that box skill with all them people around. That That's golf the ball. problem. That yeah. golf ball looked like a tic tac. It would. It would look like a tic tac and it would be taunting you. It would be looking up at you I like, won't. I dare you to hit me. Ain't, ain't no way I've hit that ball with all the people around there. Okay, well, that's the problem. And so now he's got a weather issue because yeah. the weather is going to come in today. He he's got a late tea time because you go early You're and late. then you go late. Right. So he's got the basic right. afternoon tea time. Good luck because he's going to get the thrust of it. The brunt of the, the front is going to hit. The temperature is going to drop 20, 30 degrees, and it's going to rain today. And then it's going to get real cold by Augusta right. standards tomorrow. And it's going to get very windy. How is that bailing wire going to do? <laughs> it's going to do terrible. And that's if he makes it to Saturday. Saturday. So, But when Tiger Woods say, I'm, says, I'm going to inch my way back in, I, I sit back and say, I'm you not going to bet against, against him. I'm not.